Hello Donna and welcome to Mbuga Camp. I'm your guide Chris and if you'll just follow me I'll give you a quick tour around camp. Okay, first of all through the gates you'll see Seb's tent. He is our ornithologist. Not here at the moment, but he should be back. Just behind you, you'll see Mr. Jacobs Bender. He's one of our game guards. Um, excellent at tracks. Very small, but can walk amazingly well. <laughs> Next, you'll see our food vendor. In fact, we'll go around and have a dip. In passing, this is the only chair with a back on it in camp. Luxurious, I think. So, the food. This is, this is what we eat. So as you'll see, we have some onions, tomatoes, bits of garlic and ginger, most of it probably past its best. Potatoes, that's a rare treat. Yeah, drink them in. And then several different types of flour, rice, beans. Lots of loo paper, very essential. Um, and cardboard boxes basically. So that is what we eat, not the cardboard. <laughs> but... <clears throat> okay, so if you just look behind us, you'll see Gertrude, our trusty land cruiser. She gets us where we need to be, and Hendrix, our driver, who is about somewhere, handles her excellently. Um, you'll be glad to know there are seat belts installed in the back. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, we're moving swiftly on. Um, our bins with the waste disposal service in Tanzania, we end up burning pretty much all of it. Not ideal, but we work with what we've got. Now, into the communal eating vendor. And you'll see we have a few people sat at the table Donna, meet Courtney, uh, uh, Laura, hi, Matteo. Hello. You probably know Donna. Dan. And we have hey. Latifa and Noru as well. <laughs> What's up, girl? <laughs> What's up? Oh, hey! <laughs> oh, hey. So, this is where we eat, play cards, etc. Do work, some work. Consume large work. amounts of chili sauce. Consume large amounts of chili sauce. It makes work. food taste different. Work. Yeah, work. A, a real worker. Look at them go. <laughs> yeah. Okay, onwards. <laughs> This is our water collection, all collected by hand from the pump in small buckets. Ooh. I hear you're a big fan of gardening, Donna. Now if you just follow me this way, you'll see our watermelon garden. They're looking a little bit <laughs> die, <laughs> but yeah. fingers crossed, you might get some watermelons that's, at some that's point. That's what the ash is for, isn't it? Yeah, the ash helps watermelon. <laughs> The all important science vendor where you find bikes, some of which work sometimes. Books, we have boxes and boxes of books for work and whatnot. Um, skulls, you'll notice a hippo skull and a whole range of skulls at the back. Uh, signs that need to be installed, and then various signs equipment tents and tarpaulins. Okay, continuing on. <coughs> As I mentioned, Hendrik, our driver, Gertrude's tamer, lives in this bander here. And now we are approaching the joy of communal sleeping. <laughs> Mm-hmm, yeah, yeah. <laughs> It tends to smell okay. Gets worse this as you go down. This is the communal sleeping bandit. You'll notice lots of beds, mosquito nets on the right. You've got to watch out for the malaria. And then your son's things scattered about, even though he has somehow packed. Actually, mine are nicely packed there. I don't know whose bag that is. <laughs> Shouldn't be there. Yeah, what are you doing, guys? Stop! <laughs> Kicking Don't it. a girl get any privacy around here! <laughs> That's Alex. <laughs> He's special. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Guys,
Oh, shower. You'll want to see where we managed to get ourselves clean. Well, these are examples. It's all right. Don't worry. Don't worry. I've got it. I've got it. This is a personal bucket. You take that into this shower. where you find a lovely platform, a small bucket which you can fill with water to pour on your head, and various skanky soaps and whatnot. So we try our best to stay clean, but when I say manage to get ourselves clean, <laughs> I mean struggle. Watch your head on the washing line. Be full in the dark. So you'll have to excuse me, my, my foot's a bit knackered. <laughs> um, okay, this, not so pleasant, but lots of people wonder how we get by. This is our toilet. As you'll see, we have a fully functioning engaged sign. <laughs> it was fully functioning. <laughs> <laughs> it's sometimes fully functioning. <laughs> And inside, Donna, you'll be glad to note, we actually have a real toilet seat. You won't look down the hole because you don't need to see it. Toilet paper, essential. A sink containing Dettol water. Mm -hmm. Excellent. <laughs> um, some holes that we hope will... Features. Yeah, features. <laughs> we hope the holes will support for some months more. But anyway, continue on. At this point, I'd like to let you know that James has been an incredible asset to the camp and you'll be extremely proud of what he's accomplished here. This is Phyllis Bender. She is our project coordinator and she lives here. We're enjoying the luxury of a small space. Mm. And here we have Courtney's at the bottom. Ali's Bender next, and if you can see through the grass, you'll see the lovely view over the local farmland and to the forest beyond. <coughs> the next personal Bender along, here is Adam. He's the PI, Principal Investigator, and he's doing some work in bed. Say hello Donna. Hello Donna. <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> anyway, we'll let him continue. Busy, busy man. Busy, busy man. To another very important part of him. The kitchen. As you'll see, relatively basic, doesn't have too many mod ponds, but I bet you don't have a chicken in your kitchen. <laughs> um, we have a wood fire, obviously. Kettle, always on. Good to know. This is where Ansi, our sterling cook, does what she does best, which is create specialties. Yes, rice and beans. But not to forget, delicious. Bread. It doesn't usually last long past breakfast. Um, so you'll notice our outdoor shelving rack also. Not many people have these in the UK, but they have a purpose just fine. Oh, and this is Ansi that we're about to pack now. Our camp cook. Mambo Ansi. And finally, this is our power. Three solar panels, one car battery, four sockets. All we need, <laughs> apart from a washing machine, dishwasher, computer, just power. Anyway, that, I believe, Donna, is the end of our tour. We've seen pretty much everywhere on camp, and at this point, I'd like to say I hope to see you soon, and goodbye.